Here we are, Redneck's Pride Outdoors, thoughts from the office. Just wanted to go over a quick video on some trapping procedures here with cage traps. Uh, this is a particular job that we had uh, four or five raccoons attack the uh, customer's cat and ripped it up pretty good. So we're just catching raccoons here. I've already caught, you can see in the traps, I can, uh, I've already caught uh, a couple raccoons out of the litter. I got two more that I figure I got to catch. So um, I set the traps up and I just wanted to explain what we're doing here. Uh, right here, the marshmallows. I also use eggshells, sometimes golf balls, whatever. But they are not bait. They are eye appeal. And they are indicators. Okay. Um, now the raccoons and such like to eat them but they're not here for the bait they're indicators so in other words when i come back i can see exactly what's going on just by if the marshmallows are moved or 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 eaten or taken this particular trap here we have it baited and you can see a couple of raccoon tracks right there but we have it baited with uh three baits and four lures and the baits are Banana Supreme, obviously. That's <laughs> my favorite uh, for raccoons. And uh, coon, uh, coon Corny. And uh, Hog Bait too. And the lure that we, we're using is uh, Flower Shop in the back. And then gripping into the, uh, the trap, or trailed into the trap, we have uh, Persimmon. Purple Passion and uh, Sweet Corn. All right. Over here, what we have is just lure with the with the marshmallows as eye appeal and indicators. And the uh, the four lures we have here is uh, Sweet Revenge, uh, Cherry Butter. Purple Passion, Old Swamp. All right. Oh, and I added uh, sweet corn to that one too. All right, so so uh, what we have, the raccoons will, will come right down here, they walk right here, and they, they'll walk right up that, that, that uh, alley right there, and this is where the, the cat was attacked the other night. So um, we've got the sets, the trap set here. Just a quick little video talking about some of our mindset and all of our baits and lures. This can be hosed off. This will be hosed off, so there won't there won't be any uh, uh, oil or anything like that on that. All of our baits and lures are or just a, a water soluble oil that we can get washed off. All right, so it won't be any problem. But you don't always have to posi set. I'm not against posi sets. You don't always have to force. I'm not against force. There's a time and a place that you got to learn how to trap and catch critters on their terms, not yours. All right, I'll talk to you all later. Rednecks Pride Outdoors, thoughts from the office.